Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. It's the time of Texas 502 Outdoors and today I am pretty excited about today about what came in yesterday. Uh, I will say this, this I ordered this this past Friday morning and it says it wasn't supposed to be here till like five to seven days, which was cool. I'm, I'm not worried about it. Then I got a notification Friday evening saying your package will be here Tuesday. I said, okay, great. A few days earlier. And guess what? Got a notification yesterday morning saying, hey, your package is up for delivery today. So I'm pretty excited. It's just a quick unboxing of uh, my slide that I'm going with for my uh, P80 build. This is... This is it right here. The Anderson Manufacturing slide. I haven't even opened it yet, y'all. So we're gonna get it open right quick. <clears throat> Check it out. <clears throat> oh look, it came with the uh the guide rod. And a sticker. So let's check out the slide, y'all. And that's nice. This is the Anderson and Kiger 9C Pro. The ported uh, slide, suppressor sight, uh, suppressor height sights. It is uh, optics ready with the RMR uh, footprint. Man, I like that a lot. You know, I had several different choices of, of slides to choose from, but out of all of them, I like this one the best, y'all. Let me see that. So, like all the other slides I was looking at, they all came with. Um, uh, so basically, I'm sorry. All the slides I was looking at, the ones that I really, I kind of liked a lot. They were just basically blank slides with no parts, no uh, no no sights on there. It was just a blank slide you had to build yourself, which. You know, I had no problem if I had to do that. That's fine, no issues. But you know, for this, uh, for around a little, little bit less price, I got the full slide with no barrel, which is fine because I already got a barrel, and it came with the guide rod and it's ready. Suppressor sight heights, optics cut with the ported slide. So let's uh, get this sucker out. Hold on, y'all. Let me, let me go look for my barrel right quick. I know I got it right over here. Give me one second. I'll be right back. All right, y'all, I'm back. Uh, went ahead and uh, put the slide on. Well, before I did that, I had uh, cleaned the slide, uh, lubed, lubed up the rails on there right quick. And let me tell you, I like the way it looks, y'all. You just, let's do a function check, and make sure it's gonna, uh, slide's gonna lock back with the mag in there. It does, perfect. Let's try a different mag. <clears throat> there it goes. Let's try all the mags, y'all, just to make sure. See, I'm not I'm not holding the slide back. Pulling it by hand. Stain. Let's try the other last mag. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I'm really loving that, y'all. I love the way it looks. The only thing I wish it had was the, uh, I wish it had the, the dots on there, but you know what, that's fine because I'm gonna be going with the optic on here, y'all. So I'm really loving that. The Kyger 9C Pro slide from Anderson Manufacturing. Loving that look. So it's clear. No mag, safe direction. Pull it, let's take the slide off. Oh yeah. 
Looks good, y'all. I'm highly impressed with this. Damn. There we go. That's what it looks like. But once I get the optics, it's going to look even better. And then later on, I do plan on getting the uh, the Ramjet afterburner for here for the micro compensator. Because like I said, uh, I will be using, I will be trying my hand at a competition. So this is why I'm, I did this build for competition. I'm going to try it at least once, y'all. Let's just see how I do. Because uh, a lot of my buddies, they do competition and uh, things like once or twice a month. They're always telling me, hey, let's go do competition. Let's go shoot. Let's go shoot. And I'm always like, no, nah, I don't want to. I don't want to. It's not my thing. But you know what? I decided it's like, if I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it right. I'm going to build me a pistol that's meant for competition. So I got the competition uh, trigger in here. You know, I got the got the good mags with the uh, base plate for extended. Optics ready. I wanted it with, it had to be with, with a ported uh, slide. Then I'm going to later on get the uh, the Ramjet afterburner for here. You get know, an extended uh, mag release also. And then uh, here pretty soon I'm going to also upgrade the uh, the uh, slide release to extended one also. <clears throat> I don't know if yet if I'm going to run a, a light under here. I'm not sure just yet. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes. But for now, this is my build, y'all. She's... Complete, but not complete. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm really digging it. I really am. It's beautiful. I like it a lot. But for now, this is Tom with Texas 512 Outdoors. If you, have, you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. Uh, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me, y'all. So, hope everybody has a great day. And let's get it, y'all.